now on view at Llewellyn Galleries, is an exhibition of paintings and works on paper by Woody Gwen, entitled The Earth, The Air, The Water. Woody Gwen is recognized as one of today's finest realist painters of American landscape. Known for his incredible level of detail, his use of radiant light, and an unconventional approach to composition, Gwen's paintings provide welcome reminders of the refreshing and exhilarating lucidity of nature. One of Gwen's chief concerns as an artist lies in his pursuit of what he calls the truth of the land. For Gwen, that truth would seem to exist in the most unexpected subjects, found only through a meticulous attention to the smallest slivers of visual information. As a result, Gwen's images demonstrate a devotional attitude toward detail, uncovering a meditative sense of rhythm by communicating each individual blade of grass, apple tree blossom, or current of water. Just about everything having to do with uh, art making is really about intuition. And uh, it's important for everybody, but especially I think for artists to quieten their minds so that they know how they feel about something. And uh, when your intuition says, oh, this could make a painting, you know, then the challenge is listening to your intuition and obeying it. We want to get back to those uh, moments uh, that Thomas Hardy called those moments of highest tether. And that happens in the creative process, uh, sometimes very unexpectedly. And when it does, it's great because uh, new horizons open up to you. And uh, that's a real expansive feeling. Gwen's work usually begins, in his own words, out in the field with plain air sketches and watercolors that act as direct and immediate record of his observations and impressions on sight. He paints exactingly from close study of his subject whether shimmering sea coast, highway vista, arboreal image, or southwestern mesa. Though he works with a realist sensibility, Gwyn transfigures his landscapes through a series of artistic decisions concerning subject matter and composition that embrace the unusual. His paintings and works on paper reduce the elements of landscape into powerful, contemplative dialogues between the essential forces of nature. One senses in his art a powerful depth of reflection and thought that underlays the vision of Woody Gwen. He is an extraordinary artist who engages with the land as a sacred place and dedicates his working life to expressing in his work the land's redemptive and ineffable power of beauty. I think really we only have two feelings. We are either feeling a kind of contraction or we're feeling a, a, an expansion. And the expansive feeling is the, talk, the, the, the feeling I'm talking about. And uh, I try to follow that expansive feeling. The Sanskrit phrase for art is a station that one goes to, to feel the shock of awe. Well, you know, like I say, you go through your days uh, doing all the things you have to do to keep your life going. And then every once in a while you see or hear something that, uh, that, that uh, impresses you and makes an, makes an makes you say, well, I, I want to do something to try to, to try to express this. 
Gwen's mixed media works on paper are an important part of this exhibition. These are monotypes that have been gone over with watercolor, gouache, and acrylic. While these pieces require a more direct and often experimental approach, these works convey the same majesty, grandeur, and dynamism of the landscape. A monotype is a painting, but it's also a print. It does have a directness and a freshness about it that you just can't hardly get with any other medium. And uh, the, the, the paper's glowing behind the image and shines through too. And it makes you loosen up and it makes you do things as directly as possible. And that's, that's, a good, that's a good thing, especially for someone like me. Thank you for joining us on this virtual tour of Woody Gwen's exhibition, The Earth, The Air, The Water. To view all the works included in this exhibition, you may click the link to the digital catalog in the description below.